you or your kids head out for spring break, you'll want to take some precautions so you don't bring home unwanted visitors. It might make you squirm a bit, but in today's five things, what you need to know about bed bugs. You'll thank me later. They're tiny, rusty brown in color and about the size of an apple seed. But they've become a fast-growing pest problem in recent years in homes, apartment buildings, hospitals, and college dorms. And it's estimated that 70% of hotels in the country, even those with five stars, have dealt with bed bug infestations. Matt Carroll, director of the Cleveland Department of Public Health, tells me southern and central Ohio have been hot spots, and Cleveland now has a growing problem. So definitely. Definitely over the last few years, we've seen an increase in those numbers, and it's something we're concerned about. Bed bugs are prolific breeders. They bite to feed on blood, but can survive several months without a blood meal. So your mission is to avoid bringing them home in the first place, because they are very hard to get rid of. First, when you get to your hotel room, do not put your suitcase on the floor. The bathroom is best, or on a luggage rack. When you go into a hotel room, look for possible signs of bed bugs. Look under the covers for the reddish brown spots that you might see. Look in crevices behind the bed. Look on the mattress pad, under the mattress, under the box spring to see if there might be an infestation. If you see any signs of bed bugs, ask for another room. And because your suitcase will be traveling alongside other suitcases, take care when you get home to check your suitcase thoroughly and launder or dry clean clothing right away. Bed bugs are hitchhikers. They, they really see an opportunity to grab onto something and then they come with you. Also, beware of bringing used beds or bedding into your home. Bed bugs have nothing to do with cleanliness, by the way. The numbers reported are probably low because people think there's some stigma associated with them. For more information and articles on bed bugs, head to our website, newsnet5.com.